around weather, meteorologist Matthew Euler, and this is a short range forecast for Southeast Virginia, including the city of Virginia Beach. All right, we're going to start by looking at the current satellite image. And what we see right now, there's some lower clouds down to the south of Virginia Beach. We're about right here. That's our location there. This moisture is going to continue to stream northward overnight. And by morning, as you can see, here's the radar image. This moisture is going to continue to move towards southeastern Virginia. Uh, Monday morning should overtake the area. And then last into Tuesday morning. So there's already signs that this coastal low is offshore here. Uh, there's already signs of that moisture coming up the coast. And that will overtake the area, the moisture, and the clouds here um, by late Monday morning. All right, so taking a look at the overall uh, surface chart, we have that area of low pressure right in this location that's sitting off the coast of North Carolina tomorrow by 1300 Eastern Standard Time. And that low is going to continue to move northeast just off the coast uh, overnight tomorrow night into Tuesday morning before pulling northeast of our area. There's a lot of moisture associated with that low, although we're not expecting extremely high uh, rainfall rates, but we will get some measurable rain from this system as it moves northeast along the coast. All right, and then looking ahead to the 48-hour forecast on Tuesday, the 15th of November at 1300 uh, Eastern Standard Time. You can see where that low is now. The low is well off just south of Massachusetts. It's pulled well away from our area in southeast Virginia. So, again, this isn't going to be a long-lasting storm system, and it also is not going to be a very intense one. And then looking ahead to Wednesday, the 16th of November at 1300 Eastern Standard Time, uh, the low is well up now into the Gulf of Maine uh, at 1,002 millibars by that point. Uh, we do have some higher pressure that's going to be ridging in from the southwest. You can see it here over the northern Gulf of Mexico, and that will really keep things dried out uh, for the Wednesday time period. I do want to mention, though, uh, we do have some northwesterly wind flow aloft, and there are some scattered showers here over Maryland and back over West Virginia into Pennsylvania. And so we're keeping an eye on that. Right now the forecast looks dry, but that might pivot into southeast Virginia or fairly close to our location by Wednesday afternoon and evening. So we'll have to keep a close eye on that. All right. Thank you again to Mike Foland, USA Weather, uh, for allowing me to uh, check out my site. That's why I send the graphics out on Twitter and Facebook. It's USA Weather website. Um, this is the forecast now, extended outlook for Virginia Beach. So tonight what we're looking at is increasing clouds, a low of 42. Tomorrow we expect those clouds to be uh, actually mostly cloudy conditions tomorrow on Monday with a high of 60. The rain will start by late morning, uh, last through the afternoon, and then uh, overnight, Monday night into Tuesday morning. Uh, we expect that rain to continue. And then things start drying out on Tuesday, Tuesday night, and Wednesday. As for the temperatures, tonight is going to be another chilly night. Not as cold as last night. Last night we had a low all the way down to 27 degrees. It was a very, uh, the, the first day of the frost, uh, a very thick frost, the very first day of our first sub-freezing temperature overnight. So not as cold tonight. Tomorrow we're looking at a high of 60. Monday night, 48. And then 58, a little bit cooler on Tuesday as we get northerly flow behind that departing uh, storm system as it goes up the coast. Tuesday night, looking to see a 45 degree low into Wednesday morning and then drying out Wednesday with that high pressure ridging in. Uh, again, we'll keep an eye to make sure there's no moisture that comes down from the northwest. But as of right now, it looks dry with a high temperature of 63. All right, that wraps up the short term forecast for Virginia Beach and Southeast Virginia Hampton Roads area. Uh, the latest forecast have been posted earlier this afternoon on Twitter and Facebook, the on or Spot On Weather Facebook and Twitter pages. That is all for now. Have a great evening.